Hey everybody, this is Jolene. Welcome back to the main channel and welcome to one of my favorite things that I like sharing on the channel from time to time. Anything vintage thrifted related and I love anything vintage thrifted related as far as for home decor and fashion and anything tea related. So in today's video, I wanted to go ahead and attach this video with my Las Vegas video that I filmed previously sharing what I gifted my mom for Christmas because why not? I got something for Christmas, which is totally something I gave my mom for Christmas, but in a different pattern and a very cool story. So I hope you guys enjoy these once in a blue moon videos dedicating my vintage thrifted finds. So Tristan came over two nights ago and he brought by this huge box and you're gonna see it in the vlog channel when January content goes up, me unboxing it and he ordered this really cool tea set from Ukraine. So in today's so video, I wanted to go ahead and share with you what Tristan gave me and then I'm gonna attach what I gave my mom, which I filmed maybe a week or so ago, what I gifted her for Christmas and I think it's gonna be a very fun video to look back at. So. It was really cool that Tristan ended up gifting this to me and we actually did a surprise birthday dinner for him at my house with Shannon and I used my beautiful vintage thrifted uh, tea set for the dinner and I think maybe he got inspired off of that for the gift but thank you Tristan if you're watching this video for being so thoughtful and it was very fun to unbox it on the vlog channel so stay tuned for that. So here is the beautiful pattern. And don't look too closely to my nails because there's dirt underneath it because I just filmed two Planting with Julian videos and I'm heading out the door to meet Diana. But look at the beautiful pattern. And this is what the back side of the teacup looks like. So I don't know any uh, history because he didn't send anything yet on this uh, particular set but I do know it came from Ukraine so if anybody has any idea I know some of my subscribers are also into vintage things like this so if you have any idea what brand or anything um, on this set let me know but look at the beautiful pattern so there's gold on there so there's six of these teacups here which is so adorable and the one I gifted my mom is also a set of six and then let me share with you what the sugar bowl looks like. These are the things I get excited about. What the sugar bowl, creamer bowl, serving plate looks like. As well as the teapot. So very cute. Look at that. I can't, I just can't believe it. This is so very nice of him. So shout out to Tristan for the beautiful Hoya compacted behind me and this tea set. And I asked him, I'm like, do you want this here in the Santa Monica studio? Or do you want me to take it to Las Vegas and share it? Um, with the Las Vegas collection and have it there with my mom's big collection and stay tuned when I'm there tomorrow I'll share with you at the end of this video what the collection looks like because it has grown since I last shared it so this is the creamer so side by side take a look at it it's so darling right love it I love it I can't wait and hopefully I get to do some cool afternoon high teas for 2020 because that's something I love doing and sharing on the vlog channel okay so here is the beautiful teapot I just love the scallops like look at how pretty that is so very fun set oh I absolutely love it like the light pastel colors with the pop of blue is so pretty and then here is the serving plate so I just I love this set so I wanted to share it in my vintage haul of the month i guess and also share what i gifted my mom and tristan got this online from a seller in ukraine so thank you tristan so much for the thoughtful gift and then stay tuned because in part two of this video you are going to see what i gifted my mom which was a very fun find that i found in san diego vintage thrift. before we do the vintage thrift haul of the month i wanted to go ahead and share with you ebby's little dress that my mom got her for Christmas and my brother Petty is dressed as Santa Claus but she's busy with all of her Christmas toys. So we just finished opening up gifts for Christmas and we had a beautiful breakfast. My mom and husband cooked us an amazing meal. This is my vintage outfit of the day. So this hat I picked up from 
Phoenix, Arizona, I believe. And this is a vintage blouse that I got from Amsterdam. So I wanted to share with you, and I couldn't film this before because my mom watches my channel, but I found something super cool for the month of December that I wanted to give my mom. If you haven't seen my mom's teacup collection, maybe I'll go ahead and attach it to the end of this video to share with you what her teacup collection looks like currently because it has grown since I last shared it on the channel. Watch my vintage thrift hauls this year. I've been picking up some really cool things and this is gonna like top off I think the whole 2019 uh, vintage thrifting. So let's go ahead and talk about the pieces. And I was really excited to gift this to my mom. So let's share with you what the first set looks like here. So I ended up getting this, believe it or not, vintage thrifting in San Diego. And I didn't tell my mom that and now she knows and this is a really interesting set and this is actually a japanese tea set which my mom doesn't have much of japanese tea sets she likes usually like uh, english tea set brands and she doesn't have much of japanese ones so when i seen this it was like perfect snowflakes and a little rose print of it i love it a lot so this is a really big tea set and i'm gonna share with you all of the cool pieces one at a time so there's six of these teacups and saucers which i think is really nice if you are into uh, tea sets you know that having a teacup set of six cups is a pretty big deal to stumble upon such a unique set normally you might find a set maybe with four teacups but to have six is really nice so there's six of that and then there's also six like little I want to say this could be dinner plates. You could definitely fit a lot of like finger sandwiches and macaroons. In fact, you know what? At the end of this video, I'm going to just share a little glimpse of our afternoon high tea that we did for Christmas Eve. But that will be shared on Vlogmas on the vlog channel. But I'll give you guys a little sneak peek to share with you. Uh, this is something that I just love. All things afternoon high tea. And my mom ended up picking up this huge crazy hobby. And she has a big collection. So it's very fun to see the afternoon high tea um, being shared with my grandma and my love for tea so it's pretty cool so this is another interesting part of the set this is the most cutest sugar bowl like how adorable is that and it's like the perfect size too and every time i thrift for these type of pieces to find a teacup set with the sugar bowl and creamer like in good condition is also like one of a kind rare find and this set is like in perfect vintage condition so this is what the creamer looks like like look at how pretty this is There's snowflakes in the back of it and then in the front here is that rose print and i just love the gold teeth detail anytime i see gold or silver trimming on a tea set it just really speaks to me and it's just so girly and classy i love it a lot so that was like six so we have six of these we have six of the teacup and saucers, the cream and sugar, and we also got one. I guess you want to call this like a serving plate. So it came with one serving plate, and I'll share with you what it looks like next to the dinner plates. So in comparison to the saucer. So there's one plate, and... I just I love it a lot I can't wait to see it displayed now I'm sharing the best for last and I think what makes a teacup set complete is a very unique teapot so take a look at this I love the shape of it I love how it tapers like almost like a pear shape and I love the handle too so if you look at it it's in gold and I'll give it a spin here and I immediately fell in love like Every time I vintage thrift, the first thing that I look for is the teapot because the teapot really completes the set. So if you look up close, there's that iridescent, like an AB crystal vibe to it. This is very, I don't know, I love it a lot. And then look at this. Look at just the details of it. Super cute, the handle of the lid and on the pot is so unique and precious but I love it a lot. For those of you who also love vintage thrifting, I know you guys enjoy these type of videos and I like to document for myself as well whenever I find these cool finds to so share it on the channel so every now and then you'll see me do non-plant related things on the main channel as far as for things that I am also investing my time 
and I love collecting so these are the type of things that I like to purchase anything vintage and of course tea related so I wanted to share with you what I got my mom for Christmas I had to wait till she opened it and stay tuned for the end of the video I'll share with you what the set looks like displayed and what my mom's current collection looks like I hope you guys enjoyed the video let me know in the comments down below if you enjoy vintage thrift hauls as much as I like sharing them on the channel and if you are into vintage thrifting what was the last vintage thrifting that you found I would love to see that in the comments down let below let me know what do you think about the tea set this is like really amazing I mean all the one that I found earlier in San Diego for my mom this year was really unique as well but there wasn't any iridescent and gold on it as much as this um, but still in the purple and pink tones which is also something fun to find so here's the Christmas vibes of our Las Vegas home I wanted to share with you just the top point of view before my mom puts it up on display and this is the whole complete set. Look at how gorgeous this is. This is so pretty. I love it. It's perfect. And it kind of almost matches our Christmas tree. So shout out to my mom for an owl rose gold theme Christmas tree. If you guys watch the channel, you guys know how much I love owls. And it's perfect. So can't wait to see this display so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video what i got for christmas and what i gave for christmas that was vintage tea related like how cool is that this is definitely something i'm very passionate about so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video definitely not plant related but something i like to share from time to time because these are my interests and i love sharing uh things like this on the main channel so let me know down in the comments below what do you think about the tea set do you have any information on this set let me know i asked tristan but i'm still waiting for him and maybe by the time this video goes up i'll know more about it but i just know it came from ukraine and it was packed really well so i hope you guys enjoyed this video stay tuned in the future i'll go ahead and do more videos like this from time to time inspiring all my vintage lovers and i'll see you guys tomorrow for another plant related video if you're new welcome to the channel subscribe between the main channel and vlog channel you get a video every day find me on the main channel monday to friday and the vlog channel saturday and sunday until next time hello from Santa Monica, California. Bye. This is a bonus footage of what the Las Vegas teacup collection looks like and also sound off in the comments down below if you think the set that Tristan gifted me for Christmas should live here because I asked him on his opinion if I should bring it here or leave it in my Santa Monica studio which is very small I don't have a lot of space um, but I think it might look better here so let me know in the comments down below and enjoy the updated teacup right, tour so here is a quick little overview of what the collection looks like and the new set that I gifted my mom for Christmas is up there and it's so stunning I love the way how my mom displayed it as you can see there's a few shelves left that is not teacup related my mom likes to collect uh, lucky cats and owls and it's super cute but I'm sure maybe in time these might be filled up with teacup sets because the collection is fairly new and my mom she goes hardcore like me when it comes to collecting and she got inspired to collect teacups because I am in love with afternoon high tea and we went once together and she got hooked and now we make it a tradition and you'll see in vlogmas that we go to the ward of Astoria here in Vegas for afternoon high tea every Christmas and we went again this year it was really nice my grandma was with us but just wanted to kind of give you a little walkthrough of the updated teacup collection and it's so so cute really just stare at this all day and pick which one i would want to drink out of my mom is a huge fan of all things teacup related super cool i really love all styles of teapots as you can see my mom has a good eye for collecting as well so now you know where I get my collector's habit from. I've been collecting my whole life. I still have my Barbies and My Little Ponies back home at my grandma's house from when I was a child, believe it or not, all in boxes. So it's in our blood to collect. This is actually one of the teacups that I gifted her for her birthday. I absolutely love this one. 
Hi, Ebsy. Happy Mama's home. I just got home from church, the gym, Pilates. And this is the set that I found thrifting where I got my vintage uh, swirled stand. That was a really cool find. And there's a bunch of different things. Like this is a set that I found in Poe for her. Even this was in Poe, Poe. And where else? There's a bunch. Like mostly all of these came from my finds. These ones, I believe this one came from Poe. And for all you teacup connoisseurs, enjoy the updated tour. And this is the vibe of our kitchen. I absolutely love so it. Thank you guys so much for supporting my love of all things vintage. And I hope you guys enjoyed this bonus tour of what the collection looks like in Las Vegas. Bye.